Welcome back to 100 Reps Six Pack Abs. We are on day seven and we are going to be doing sexy and I know it. <laughs> okay, so this one is really great for not only strengthening our core and our back, but also our arms. So your arms are getting a little bonus workout in all of these exercises. So let's go ahead and get started. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel if you have not yet, and check in with me after each workout so you can be eligible to win the prizes. Okay, so we're gonna go onto our forearms. Make sure that you are um, having your shoulders over your elbows, forearms are parallel to one another, and what you're going to be doing is you're gonna stay as solid as a plank, right, that's why it's called a plank, piece of wood, and you're going to just slide forward and slide back. Okay, so I'm just pushing into my toes, so you see how I'm pointing my toes, and then I'm flexing my feet like this. So it's really the movement is coming from the ankles, and then that's what's driving the whole movement forward and back, okay? So let's go ahead and get started. We'll take some breaks as we need it because this is probably a little bit more of a challenging one, but I know you guys love the challenge of all of this. So let's go ahead and get started on our forearms. Remember, um, our, I always like to say forearms are like railroad tracks. They're parallel to one another. All right, let's go forward and back, forward and back, forward and back. Great job. So you wanna think about pushing the elbows into the floor so that you can actually spread the shoulder blades apart. Instead of sinking in your shoulders, okay, do not do that. Make sure that you are lifting up out of the shoulders so that my shoulder blades are actually spreading apart and I'm doming, like as if you were doing a Halloween cat, like a cat cow in yoga, you wanna spread those shoulder blades apart. Nice, so here you're gonna also feel the inner thighs working. You're gonna feel the quads engaging up. Good. So, this is going to be a challenging one. That's 20 right there. Forward and back. Forward and back. Really pull that belly button in. Tuck the pelvis under, squeeze that booty a bit. Okay, that's 25 right there. Let's take a breather. Okay, so we're gonna take a sphinx pose here to rest and just recuperate. Take a few deep breaths in. Just remind yourself of why you began, right? That's always so key, I always talk about that. Why is this important to you? And let's get into it. Come on up, press the elbows into the floor. We're gonna go forward and back, forward and back. You are so, so strong. So take this time, this opportunity to work on your form. There's so much in plank that you can always build upon. So maybe this time you do this round, you're thinking of squeezing your inner thighs together. I think that's a really important place that gets forgotten about. Or you wanna focus on your shoulders, shoulder placement. So pushing the elbows into the floor, dome in the upper back. So the, um, the, the back is almost creating like a roundedness at the very top, much like you were doing a cat cow. So think of that Halloween cat position where you're doming in the upper back. That's what you wanna feel like. Good. So we've got five more and then we're gonna take a another little break. Four, three, two, pull that belly button in, and one. Let's take a breather. Whew, I told you you'd be learning about muscles and feeling them and seeing them for the very first time through this 30 day challenge. Okay, pretty exciting, right? We don't really slow down lots of times. We are always like speeding up really fast in our lives. So this is a chance for you to really, really improve the mind-body connection between you and your core. Okay, so let's come on up. Let's go to that next section. And here we go. So we're just taking this into four sections to make it more manageable. Of course, you can always stop when you need to. Otherwise, you know, see how much you can build each time. Also, what we're working here a lot in this sliding forward and back is the serratus muscle. The muscle is like a knife edge, like a serrated knife that's jagged all the way down to the ribs. So you might feel the outside of the ribs a little sore, thinking, what is that? And that is your serratus it's going to help improve your posture a lot. It'll help take tension out of your neck and your low back. So this, I know this challenge for you, is going to make your body feel completely different than when you first started. You're gonna feel tall, proud, have amazing posture. And you know, your posture energetically really, really helps to improve your mood. Okay, 
little breather. So when, you, when you're standing tall and your body is in a position of strength, it'll, t it'll relay a, a feeling of confidence, right? So it begins here, that feeling of confidence, of creating the strength, the structure with or around your core. So it's pretty exciting, right? That you can just change your mood, change the way that you portray yourself and come off to the world just by doing core work, just like this. Okay, so you should be very proud of yourself. Here we go, last 25 reps. Let's do this, come on up and let's go. And back, forward and back. Again, where can you build? Maybe you can squeeze your booty a little bit more. Maybe you can pull the frontal hip bones those two points there, like your headlights, up a little bit more towards your ribs. Maybe you can bring your ribs down a little bit more towards your hips. And breathe. Remember, nice steady breaths in and out through your nose. Good, 10, here we go, count down with me, nine and eight. Make sure that you're checking in with me, seven, Six, using that hashtag stretchy fit abs. Five, and four, and three, and two, and 100. Woo, you did it. Great job today. Remember that every single time you show up on your mat for one of my workouts, you are getting stronger and more confident every single day. So check in with me using the hashtag stretchy fit abs. And remember that this entire 30 day challenge is available inside of my stretchy fit app where you can download the videos and watch without Wi-Fi. Pretty cool. Plus there are exclusive workouts, programs, challenges. We've got an amazing community inside of there as well. And I give new workouts every single week. It is amazing. Definitely check that out. The link is in the description box below. So download, you can start your free trial today and I will see you in our next video. Love you so much. Bye.